run the highball inspiration time. And I'm so excited to bring this one to you today. Uh, the rum, we are, you haven't got a name for this, so you'll have to get in the comments uh, below and give and name this drink. Um, but the rum comes from the amazing uh, John and Gina down in Goldstone, uh, sort of Sussex near Brighton. I uh, love this. This is their lime and ginger rum. Actually distilled with a shed ton of limes and a lot of kilos of ginger. This stuff is phenomenal. We're going for some apricot syrup. We're going from Lushcombe's rhubarb soda, which is a belting. And we're just gonna tailor that off with some fresh mint. So no need to shake this one. This can get built straight in a glass and feel free to up the measurements as well. But I'm going for 45 mil, one and a half ounces of the lime. It just, it just pops a lime of ginger. This stuff is gorgeous. Now I've opted for an apricot syrup instead of an apricot brandy because I just like the little bit of extra sweetness that this brings. And I think it'll be more in tune to your palates. But 15 mil, half an ounce of apricot syrup. The mojito style, you just want to pick off eight to 10 mint leaves. Remember, you don't need to muddle them. You don't need to bash the hell out of them. All you need to do, palm your hand, smell them. Mm, lovely mint, spank it. Mint on steroids, so eight to 10 mint leaves in your glass. Now I'm not going for any citrus juice in here, lemon or lime juice. Feel free to add a couple of wedges of lime if you want to, but I just think the tartness of the rhubarb, even though it's not citrus, kind of balances this out perfectly. So these are 270 ml bottles, half a bottle, 125, 150 ml, give or take, just in your glass. A little bit of ice just to start you off. Long bar spoon, mainly just to stir the syrup in because the syrup will be a little bit heavier. And then just fill your glass with more ice. Remember, the more ice you have in your glass, the colder it stays for longer, therefore the less dilution you get. And then to garnish, nice old bouquet of fresh mint. Come on kids, what are we calling this? Lime and ginger rum, apricot, lushcombe rhubarb soda, give it a name. Seriously, if you're having a party, if you run a pub or bar, stick that on your cocktail menu. That will flip and fly out the doors. You don't lose that rum one bit. The lime and the ginger really comes through. The touch of the apricot just balances that out. But the rhubarb soda, the rhubarb soda with a kind of a light rum, it's just gorgeous. 